Hello Eurovox, this is Chris here. And Jess. And we are live here from the Minsk Arena in Belarus, where today the first live rehearsals have begun for 10 participating countries. And we're going to talk about some of them right now. <laughs> So the first country to take to the stage today was Armenia and we had Levon with his self-titled song Levon and uh, Chris what did you think of the rehearsal? I personally really liked it. You see Levon and he comes across as quite the star. The song is about him and the song is perfect for him actually. He is actually the star of the show. Mm. The first thing you notice when he comes on stage is his green suit, you can't not miss that. That's his trademark yeah. suit there. And the trumpet as well. And he's got the trumpet. He, he blows his own trumpet <laughs> in the video, certainly, and in the live rehearsals. We also found the song suits him, I find. Definitely. His voice is really good. Uh, the only thing I say, he um, needs backing dancers personally, I think. I it, completely agree. He seems to miss the backing dancers yeah. there. However, some may argue in regards to Levon there, He's a big enough personality and his voice is big enough to actually carry the song mm. through without the dancers anyway. Yeah, I pretty much agree with everything you said. He was very confident on stage and it kind of, he came across very well on stage as well. But for me personally, I would like to see dancers yeah. because it's such an energetic song. I feel like it needs more power. But it, nevertheless though, he delivered good vocally and kind of visually. So. I'm expecting good things for Armenia this year. Yes, I think yeah. definitely top, top 10 definitely. He's one of the mm. favourites, but top top 10 definitely. For me, top, top five, five yes. I think. Yeah. Awesome. So yeah. now we're going to go to the next country, which was... Australia. Australia. This year, Australia will be presented by Jail Werner, if I'm saying that correct. I think it's I'm Jail, maybe? Jail, Jail Werner, I do apologise. Yeah. Um, with the song Champion. And she's definitely a champion. Definitely. The first rehearsal, the thing that really stuck you was that the street staging was absolutely perfect. Yes. She was there, stood in a silver dress, singing her heart out. She seemed to have hit all her high notes. But what I felt with the, the actual performance was that the staging absolutely suited the song. Oh, yes. The lights shone on Jael Gwena and when she performed it was absolutely perfect. Definitely, completely agree. Um, in terms of kind of how she was on stage, I kind of felt like she was a bit nervous. I don't know if you noticed that, but for me, it felt like at the beginning she was a bit nervous and then she went through the song quite a few times and I thought she got more confident as it went on. But um, like Chris said though, the staging and the lighting and the outfit and everything, it's just spot on. They've done an amazing job. And personally, I, th I find with this song that it sounds better live than it does mm. on the actual official yeah. video. She has got an amazing voice and she can really hit those high yeah. notes. Australia have chosen a really good singer and a really good song this year. I expect high votes mm. for Australia. I think they're going to surprise many with how well they're going to do mm. this year. I have a sneaking suspicion, possible winner. Yes, I can agree. Yeah. I got a bit of goosebumps here in her singing. So did I. I didn't. I didn't get the nervousness from her when I personally mm. watched the video but I genuinely think she could she could win she's got yeah. such an amazing voice awesome and so the last country in this video will be Azerbaijan so Azerbaijan so Fidan I felt like she was channeling her inner eye cell yes definitely. in terms of outfit and choreography which is not a bad thing because eye cell was brilliant on stage in my opinion yes um, I found even hand movements echoed yeah. ISIL's performance from the Definitely. Eurovision this year. Um, Vidan oh. sounded really good on stage. Her vocals were good, I thought. And she seemed confident on stage. Yes. But for me personally, the staging with the dancers doesn't quite work with the song. And I think it would be better to have just Vidan alone and not all this choreography. I agree. Her voice is so powerful. It's I'd use the words angelic personally. She yeah. she can really sing and she comes across as angelic, mm. innocent, very friendly on st stage. I felt it was too busy behind her with the song personally. And I think she didn't really need the backing dancers mm. personally. I think her on her, on her own yeah. would have been perfect. 
But as first rehearsals go, she hit every note. Good. She seemed confident, yeah. she seemed comfortable. But best of all, she seemed to really enjoy the yeah. experience. You could really see that in her voice. Yeah. And, uh, and even the high note at the end, she nailed it on yeah. every take. Perfect, perfect. So, but this is Azerbaijan. You can always expect high exactly. things from Azerbaijan. So we've heard the first three songs. Yep. Do you agree with us? We think the three songs so far have been fantastic. Yes. We would like to know your opinions. You can subscribe on the, to us via YouTube. And please give this video a like, like and a it. thumbs up. So and from us from the very cold Belarus, <laughs> we'll see you next time with the next three videos from the rehearsals. Bye Goodbye. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.